Jadine, there's food in the fridge at home. Go home and make something. Hi guys. Battery's blinking, I must have forgot to charge it. I just got home from work and while I was at work today, I made these elaborate plans that I was gonna come home and I was gonna steam fish and whatever. <laughs> Boy, who did I think I was kidding? starving I'm very glad that I bought these grilled and ready chicken breast strips from Target because honestly besides the fact that I'm trying to eat healthier and I'm like eating the healthier part of the chicken which is supposed to be the breast um I'm starving and I need something to cook and I just have to run by the full start which is pretty great like I leave work at a good time to do a lot of things still because it's 4 or 5 right now and I was able to pop by the post office and drop off a package and then um on my way back, I was contemplating if I wanted to just buy a sandwich because I was starving so bad. I'm like, my head was already hurting and everything, but I decided, Janine, there's food in the fridge at home. Go home and make something. So, I'm gonna make a chicken sandwich and a cup of tea. Because like I expressed, my head really, really hurts and I do not like that I also just got a package I'm gonna pop it open here in a minute they did this little patio outside and it's so cute that means that the packages could successfully go to the back of the house and not get wet because of course that would be the one thing that I'm concerned about so I wanted to try a new part wig and that's what I bought hopefully I like it but honestly I don't have time to get into it right now it's supposed to match my curls my natural curls that's also something we're gonna have to see as time progresses i need to confirm that i got it this is jet black which means i'm gonna need to dye my hair it looks super wavy and like not the best quality fresh out of the bag but i guess i will see as time progresses i'm gonna just put it down over here because one i do not have time for this right now so this is gonna have to be on one of my day offs on a day where I'm washing my hair to see if I wanna do all of this. But um, for the most part, I felt like I needed one. And so I didn't got me one. So now we can throw out the trash and confirm that I received it. Let me wash my hands, I'm starving. Oh my gosh, I put the kettle on here and forgot to turn it on. Cut up these chicken breast strips. Microwave it again because I just gave it a minute to kind of like defrost a little bit because I'm taking this out of the freezer. I didn't want to leave it in. I didn't want to leave it in the bottom of the fridge for it to like go bad. But the way how I'm blazing through each packet of this as well. And luckily I just bought a new one the other day because the first one that I had was running out. But I'm not gonna lie, this Target same day delivery is really killing me. Like it's really taking all my money. Alright, so I'm gonna eat, slip out of these scrubs, jump into that bed, sleep for an hour, whatever time it is, and then when I wake up back, I'll figure out how the rest of my evening will go after that. But for now, we're gonna sleep. So I'm sitting down at work and I just decided to go in and pay off the $300 that I had on my credit card because I just feel like these, I really hate owing these little debts. Like, it's just dragging and dragging and dragging. And yesterday, I spent like, 80 something dollars on there and i'm just like yeah i'm gonna just pay this off like 
I'm not gonna sit here and allow this to like accumulate or whatever. Plus these small debts, because you think of it as so small, like you don't realize that it's adding up. And before you know it, it's like a thousand dollars and we're not doing all of that. So I paid it off and I felt good. I'm at work on I'm sitting in the little locker room. It's exactly how somebody's little coat is hanging over me right now. But I have to go to my other job this evening and I already feel so, so tired. And I just feel like that is my body telling me that I'm extremely tired even though yesterday I went home and slept for damn near two hours and still slept pretty good last night. My body is just telling me that I'm tired because I've, I've been feeling lately like, you know, I just don't want to go there anymore. Mainly because one, they be changing the damn managers like so, so much. And I don't know, I just feel like the standing for 10 consecutive hours is not it for me anymore like i'm not i remember when another lady used to work there her she used to have this problem with like her heels and she said it's from like years of standing and i'm not about to do all that to myself and i feel like too along with standing for so long they be acting like if there are no customers in there and you sit for like five little minutes it's the end of the world and i'm just like listen i'm not gonna argue with nobody that means that i'm gonna continuously go to the bathroom every hour for 15 minutes because how do you expect me to stand here for 10 hours and not like one 30 minute break within a 10 hour shift? Like how do, are y'all crazy? No. Hi guys, today is Saturday. And of course, I would definitely be the one who put some mascara on today. <laughs> Knowing good and well that I'm working both demanding jobs that I have for pretty much all of the day. like. I'm going to be seen by everybody and nobody. Maybe that's why I decided to put it on because I'm leaving the nursing home and popping up straight at the retail. So that should be fun. Yesterday, the day went by really quickly though, I'm not going to lie. And I'm praying that I'm on the same floor today with the very same assignment. And that should help because that assignment was pretty good. And... It gave me a lot of downtime so that oh, it's windy. Listen, it is cold. I don't understand why it's still cold. However, it gave me a lot of downtime where I was able to rest up a little bit. So when I actually went to the retail job, I didn't feel like I was like super tired or like dying. Plus it's just a few hours. So that was good. And normally I will leave out earlier than this in the mornings. It's been a while that I haven't left out this late, but I had a few little things to do this morning. So I'm just like, let me give myself a little grace. Um, not that it helps when I get to work earlier or whatever, because you end up where you end up and you do what you do anyways. So I'm just like, whatever, it's not that serious. I'll just take my time. And so I did exactly that. I'm really waiting for it to get warm to the point where I can actually start wearing my Crocs again because those are super comfortable. I mean, not that my shoes are uncomfortable because these ones I just bought them, but the cracks just hit different. I also just realized a couple of days ago that I've been getting these breakouts on my face, like underneath my chin and like on the side here. And I rarely ever have breakouts, not even when I'm PMSing. I don't necessarily break out like that. And it has not been making me happy at all. And see, the fact that I know that they're there, I just keep picking on them and that doesn't help either. But it's like once you know and you can like feel them, it's over. Anyways, I'm doing my little 10 minute walk out the block to go catch a bus. I'll see you guys later.